Hi guys, so today I just wanted to talk a little bit around social norms. I mean, what is normal? How do we actually define it? But I can guarantee that most people walk around operating in a particular way that feels that they have to hold themselves back in different positions or different situations that they're in just because it's socially normal to do so. And the reason why this is quite prominent in my mind is because I went to a festival last weekend and if you've ever been to a festival, you will understand exactly what I mean here. But the moment you drive through the gates, it's almost like all the rules of society just go right out the window. People wear what the hell they wanna wear. Maybe it could be quite wacky clothes or whatever. And then people, randomers, come up and compliment you on it. People, strangers talk to each other. Everybody's much more engaged. People start talking to the person that's serving them when they're buying something. People embrace more of a fun side about themselves. There's more spontaneity. People can do things without the fear of judgment or criticism. For example, I saw a group of adults just rolling down a hill having a race to the bottom. I bet that group of people wouldn't do that at the local park. And I can also bet you that half the people that attended that festival at least have gone back to work this week and have stood in an, in an elevator um, with a group of complete strangers and not said a damn word. Imagine operating in that particular way when you go to a festival. It'd be the most boring thing you'll have ever attended. So why do we do it in one environment and not another? Because of these social norms that we restrict ourselves. So I guess the point that I'm trying to get to is have a think what your rule book is, have a think what your norms are, and start finding ways to break your own rules. Now I went through this exercise a number of years ago with my coach, and for example, I went and bought a couple of pairs of jeans when I was in Next, and when I got to the checkout, I simply said there's only chance I could get a discount, and they just randomly gave me 50%, 15 sorry, percent off. I couldn't believe it. So it wouldn't have even crossed my mind that I could have even asked for that because it wasn't considered normal to, to get a discount in Next. So how many other opportunities and how many other times that we could have maybe engaged with other people do we not do because it might be seen as a bit weird or not socially normal? So again, I'm just trying to reiterate, don't do anything that is gonna cause harm to yourself or other people or maybe risk your career. I'm not suggesting rocking up to work an hour late, but think about the rules that you do have that you stick to, that you've probably habitually learned that you've done for decades. Maybe the things that you eat for breakfast, maybe what you eat for dinner, maybe the way that you drive to work, maybe the direction you drive to work, maybe the things that you normally say no to, maybe say yes, maybe things you normally say yes to, say no. Start doing things differently that don't cause harm to you or anybody else and see what different things happen and how much opportunity and more fun there is to embrace out there and the things that we're not doing because they're not socially normal. I'd love to hear any of your stories if you get up to some of this jazz this week. Um, if, As usual, if you thought it was useful, please, please like it, share it if you think it will help others and I'll catch up with you soon. Cheers.